Willem Dafoe's Green Goblin mask is known around the world, but for a period of 20 years, he actually hated the mask. Starting off, Willem Dafoe's Spider-Man No Way Home co-star Alfred Molina didn't want to be in the movie originally. That's because Alfred Molina last played Doc Ock in 2004, and 17 years later, at the age of 67, he didn't think he looked right for the role. The way Marvel ended up getting him to return was by promising him to use CGI to make him look like he was 50 years old again. There was Lizard actor Ricey Fonz who couldn't make it to filming due to contractual issues. The exact same happened for Sandman actor Thomas Hayden Church. But to get them back in, they just got them to do voice roles and reuse footage from previous films. Willem Dafoe, they actually made him the same offer thinking he wouldn't want to return to Spider-Man and just offered him a voice role instead. The original plan being to have another actor wear the mask, have Willem Dafoe voice, and just do a small cameo at the end. Willem Dafoe was a hard note of the idea with two requirements, the first being that he got to do his own stunts. The second being that he didn't have to wear the mask from the original movie. And that's because making the first Spider-Man movie, there were a lot of pitches for how the Green Goblin should look, and Willem Dafoe wasn't a huge fan of how the character ended up looking. 20 years later, he got to break that mask, and with that, I'm Charles Peralta, subscribe if you learned something.